Okay, coach, so kind of break down the, today's match for us. Yeah, uh, we continue to get better with each one. I think it's one of the things. And uh, I thought there were some little things that we upgraded from last night. Um, and just what I told the team in the end is uh, we've found ways and we're going to get into holes. We're going to dig them. But we found ways out of them in the last two matches. And that's the thing I'm most proud of. So four games in, four straight wins. Kind of what have you seen so far in the early part of the season? I think there's inconsistency and consistency. Uh, I think it's very uh, unique for a team to hit over 300 for, what is it, four matches now. Uh, and I think that's um, a testament to our setters, the choices, us being a well-balanced team, being able to get multiple group people involved on different nights. Uh, and I think that's the consistency piece. And I think in order for us to step it up as an elite team, we need to be able to take care of the little touches that are inconsistent or the pressure they were able to put on another team consistently uh, and making sure those happen time in and time out, time out. So final game of the Invitational tomorrow, what are you hoping to see differently or see continue? I think a little bit the same. And I think some of the inconsistencies that I'm talking about, they're slowly improving. So it's making small little changes on those. Uh, and then again, a, a really, really good team uh, that went out and beat Purdue last week. So I want to see a show up. Um, I think the other thing, cool thing about tonight, probably won't happen tomorrow, but uh, we had an awesome environment here at Bowling Green. Uh, and it's something that we're trying to create at Texas A&M, a, a, a rowdy student section uh, that cheers for their team. So uh, it was really awesome to play in front of them. Uh, and entertaining, and uh, I hope our team enjoyed it too.